today, or, well, yesterday, we made a Funko Pop trade. What's going on, guys? Fabian's Funko Pops here. Now, today, I have five Funko Pops that I got from a Funko Pop trade yesterday. I couldn't make the video yesterday because we were having a party and everybody was over and a few people were in our room and it was just too loud. I really couldn't make a video. So now I can finally make a video on these. Now, before we do anything, look, I show you guys the pops. I'm going to um, show you guys what we traded. So I traded two games. I traded Call of Duty Modern Warfare and um, WWE 2K20. I traded Amethyst. My Joker, the purple Joker that I had. Uh, mm -hmm. I don't remember. I don't really remember who else. Oh, Iron Man, Doctor Strange, and Groot. So I traded those five, six, seven. I traded like those seven items, and I got five items. Now, a lot of you probably think I got scammed. Well, you guys wait to see this. I think I actually came up high in profit, but. Here's a picture of what I traded this person. Or here's pictures. See, I know sadly I had to let that amethyst go. Um, just because, you know, it's the only way that I would get any of this good stuff. Because that one was worth 33. Uh, but I actually traded that one for one of these pops. So, we have five. And... Let me tell you guys, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys will see, uh, Instagram or Snapchat, that I got $147 in value of five Funko Pops right here. And all these, all these are probably worth maybe like, I'd say about like 200, but like two to 300, but these, this is just five and it's literally like maybe 67 subs. 67 uh, dollars away from 200 but anyways let's get on with this first one now this one i got this one for my dad i know i traded some of my stuff but i got this one for my dad from the two games <clears throat> <clears throat> sorry because i was trying to get rid of those two games so i was like you know i need to get rid of these games and my dad really my dad needs this pop um so if you guys don't know early yesterday when we made the uh, smugglers bounty box video um I showed this in the video. I showed uh, this Luke Skywalker right here with Yoda. <laughs> you can't really see it to get it focused, but in this set is um, this Princess Leia, Luke's training Luke Skywalker, Han Solo, and Carbonite. Uh, another Princess Leia and Han Solo. <clears throat> now. This is number 362. This is the um, 40th anniversary, The Empire Strikes Back. And this thing, this thing had a sticker on it for $10.99. I pulled the sticker off. It was right here. But it had a sticker for from this place, and it was $10.99 $10 at that place. I looked this up on the Funko app. And um, also, after um, we review all five, all five of these... I will pop up um, also at the end of the video some pictures of their current PPG value or PPG yeah PPG value um, what they're going for right now so just so you guys have proof of that these are worth 147 but I looked up her value because um, I was confused on that 1099 sticker and she is going for like $30 right now and that's crazy. I do have to give this one up to my dad because, you know, I'm a good kid. I love my dad, and he will only need two more Funko Pops in this set. So I'm trying to help my dad out because um, my dad has, like, maybe about 50 Funko Pops. Um, and also this one, the Smuggler's Bounty Box. Now, it wasn't mine. It was my dad's. He, well, the whole box, besides the Funko Pop, was mine. But, um, he wanted the, the only thing he wanted was a Funko Pop, so I said, alright, just let me at least review it for my channel. Um, so they actually, like, know and I can make a video on it. Um, I might get one in the future just to have the Funko Pop in my collection. But that's why I won't, because me and my dad are gonna get a house, and that's when I'm gonna have, like, my own room. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna actually get a 
bigger and better setup so um it won't have to be like this and maybe i can be like winko and stuff like how i have a table and then a nice camera and you guys will see but when we get a house um my dad's gonna give me his 50 funko pops you know just because he wants to collect them for now where we're at right now just because we have space so he doesn't want to have them in his room um because he doesn't want people going over and thinking he plays with the toys so he's gonna give them to me and i'm excited that he's giving them to me because he has one he has one of my pops um like i told you guys he has my x-man uh, i don't know if i told you this but he has an x-man wolverine one from me and uh it's like an old man logan um, I will put a picture of that one at the end after I show all the value of this, but it's a it's an X-Men old man Logan and Last time we checked it was going for like a hundred bucks And he called a collectibles place and they said that if he brought it in that they would take it for a hundred and That's crazy because that's probably one of my most valuable pops um, like with all these combined But yeah, uh, anyways, I'm just excited because he has like that notorious big he has tupac he has ice cube um a lot of star wars ones and some movie ones it's just cool so he's gonna be happy uh when he sees this so yeah guys that was the first one now let's get into the second one now i'm trying to debate okay because all right we'll do this one so this one is a Funko 2020 Spring Convention Limited Edition Exclusive. I think this came out like I don't know when this came out. This probably came out like two or three months ago, because that's when we saw them uh, restocked in uh, our my dad's and his GameStop. But my dad really wanted this one. He's gonna be so mad when he sees that I got this, because this is one that he wanted. Because it was uh, this thing right now goes for i think 33 dollars and he wanted this because at gamestop they were selling it for like 20 and he's like he kept telling me back and forth should i get it should i not get it should i get it i was like if i were you i would get it because later it's not gonna be there and you're gonna be mad and when we went back to every gamestop and they did not have it so he did not get to pick it up but i picked it up so here's what it looks like here is the front i don't know if you can see the sticker it is number 592 here is the side where his full body he's uh kneeing he's kneeling on his knee and the side of his face is like burnt from when he snapped his finger and the gauntlet you can put it on his hand um but also it's off because they cut the gauntlet off of his hand and there's the ones you can collect in the back now what's cool about this um i thought is it's in like the it's in this set where they're wearing their Avengers suits, um, so they can time uh t time travel and go get the time stones back. Hulk, the Hulk that I'm giving away in the uh, 400 subscriber giveaway is in this. But yeah, again, this will probably be this set in the back will probably be the set that I collect like later, later when like I have almost every Funko Pop in my collection right now. Uh, like fully set and this one will be one that I'll get later just because of you know Iron Man the Thanos and then Captain Marvel Ant-Man Thor uh, and Captain America but this one was a key because this one is not on the back this is a 2020 spring convention exclusive so that is cool and this thing does go for 33 again at the end I will pop a picture up for you guys so you guys um, can believe me so yeah now let's get into this one this is one i saw this person by the way i traded this guy on offer up i saw this guy's page on offer up and we were only supposed to be trading for two and then i was like oh my god i have to get this one so then it was three and then it was uh thanos and then it was leia so it turned out to be five but oh my god when i saw this i had to have this i looked up the value for this and oh my lord i pretty sure i traded um I think it was the Joker and I want to say the Joker and Doctor Strange for this one but it is worth it because two of those combined both of those were maybe like 15 bucks here's what we have we have the Target exclusive flocked balls eye dude I looked the value up on this thing and 
there's two of them. That's weird, because on the Funko app, there's two of them. Maybe there's one limited to Target, and there's one not limited to Target. This is the one limited to Target, and this one goes for $35, guys. I treated $15, two, 15, two pops, $15 in value for a $35. I just made, like, 20 bucks in profit. Oh, my God. And he is flocked. I felt him. I lifted up the tab in the top. I felt him. He is fuzzy. But I only did that. This is a pop that I... See, the five of these pops that are in this video, especially the last one that I'm going to show you guys, are not coming out of the box because their PPG value is high. And I'm pretty sure someday their values will go even higher. But here's the back. You can't... I don't know if you'll really get to read it if I leave it. You can read it, pause the screen. But I'll read it to you guys. <clears throat> so the back says Bullseye has been Target's official spokespup since 1999. He's the life of the party wherever he goes from store openings to award shows at Hollywood, red carpet events. He might just be the world's most lovable bull terrier so he is his breed is a bull terrier i love dude bull terriers are so cute i might actually get one in the future it's a, they're so cute but this one is the target on this face yeah guys i thought this was a pretty cool one that i picked up and, and um i am starting my ad collection or my ad icon collection so as you can see it's really blurry um if i maybe this way I really don't know how to do this, but I'm pretty sure you guys have seen most of them. If so, if you can kind of see right here, okay, I'll just show you, tell you what it is. So right here, I have Sprout from um the Green Giant. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's like a vegetable brand, like um the green beans and all that. I have Sprout. Um, I am getting the Jolly Green Giant soon when I find him. Um, I have Colonel Sanders. This is number five. That's weird too, because this one is number five, but that one is number five. And I thought they go by the ad icon numbers, which is pretty weird because I didn't know that they had two number fives. I thought if they had two number fives, it would be the chase variant of one of them, but oh well. Colonel Sanders and Cap and Crunch, and you guys know, if you know, you know, you can kind of see them in the back peeking out. I have a 10 inch Kool-Aid man, guys. That was another Funko Pop trade I made. Uh, I traded... I can't remember. I traded Oogie Boogie, my Oogie Boogie Man, and someone else for him. I don't remember. I'll probably find out in the future for you guys. But yeah, guys. This was another cool one to pick up. Because I am trying to finish uh, and start my own Ad Icons collection. Which is pretty dope. So, he shall go right there with his fellow Ad Partners. And... Okay, let's just pretend you guys didn't see that. I don't have an editor, and I can't really fully edit my videos, so... Let's just pretend you guys didn't see that. Uh, I'll make sure it's not damaged later, but now, this is the, um... Second last one. This is another ad icon. This has been a Funko Pop ad icon that... Or, not even just an ad icon, just a Funko Pop that I've been looking for since forever. I've wanted this pop since I found out the first day that it came out. Because, I mean, it's the sweet one. <laughs> okay, sorry, that was cringy. Um, I don't even think you really hear me. I said it's the sweet one. But it is the Funko Pop Dr. Pepper exclusive Little Sweet, guys. You, you can't go wrong with the Little Sweet in your collection. Because... It's the sweet one. <laughs> that I love that phrase. Oh my god, that phrase is so cool. Especially, uh, he's like, he's actually little. Like, you know, you got the size of a real human. And he's actually little. And <laughs> it's crazy. Uh, I will show you guys the comparison, Um, you know, with the next one's up. Because it's just like a, it's basically like a, a human comparison. But I thought this was pretty cool. Um... Now, when I looked inside closely, his, uh, I don't know if you can be able to see it, but he has, like, a little, um, scarf, and it is glittery. Um, 
But yeah, Dr. Pepper, um, since 1885. This is number 79 in the ad icons set, I'm assuming. But yeah, guys. We finally got a little sweet. It's the sweet one. Oh, and the fact that he's holding a Diet Dr. Pepper can is so hilarious. Oh my god, that's so cool. But anyways, alright. So, I'm gonna put him aside so we can do our little human comparison. Now this, this is the last Funko Pop we have to review to you guys in this one. This one. Now, this is a, uh, I have, this is a WWE one. I have one WWE one, um, which is Mr. McMahon. I'm currently in a giveaway for the Dwayne The Rock Johnson pop, or it's not Dwayne The Rock Johnson, but it's The Rock um, from the old WWE series when they first made WWE pops. I'm trying to win that one. I might win it, maybe not. If I do, that'll be cool, because then I would have three. But right now I have two um, WWE ones and I have a UFC one, so I have three fighting ones. This one, I had to pick this one up. This is a six inch Funko Pop. Uh, I'm trying to get like small Funko Pops to big Funko Pops, like um maybe like not even the four inch ones, like these sizes, because the figurines not um mainly four inches. The figurines probably maybe like a two inch. No, no way, it's two inches. Hey, eh? what am I saying? I don't know, guys. Because this has to be, I don't know, that's weird. But this is a six inch pop. So the pop figure, no wait, the pop figures are four inches. The boxes are like five inches. Okay. So, oh my god, it's so cool. We have ourselves a six inch pop. Now, I was saying the other day to myself, the Gremlins one right here is technically a six inch, but it's technically not just because the box. So, all right, enough talking. Right here, we have the WWE Walmart exclusive Andre the Giant. Now, this thing does look like a normal Funko Pop. It is not a normal size Funko Pop. Here's a little sweet. This is a little sweet thing like that. But there is a little sweet, guys. Now, this was the human comparison I was gonna make. Now, this is like the size of little. So, say this is a normal human, normal size human, which it is not. Trust me. Andre the Giant is a giant. But just say this is a normal human, and this is a little sweet. He literally went to their feet. Or at least their knees. He literally went the highest he got to was to your knees. Which I thought was pretty cool. But anyways, the Walmart, only at Walmart, Walmart exclusive, Andre the Giant. This was a keep. This was a pickup, and I'm never getting rid of this one. Because, you know, Andre the Giant was a legend. He will always be a legend. But here are the five you can get on the back. Now, sadly, these ones aren't six inches, which I thought they should be. But they're not. They're, this one's only a six inch because he is a giant in real life, and these guys are normal size. But you have the John Cena, the You Can't See Me Invisible one. You have Randy Orton doing his little pose. Who is that? Uh, Batista? Yeah, you have Batista, uh, Charlotte Flair, and Ric Flair. Charlotte Flair and Ric Flair, I think they're a two-pack. I'm pretty sure they're a two-pack Funko Pops that... Which, I will have to be picking those ones up if they are a 2-pack, because you can't go wrong with um, a flare pack. But anyways, here's what he looks like fully out of the box. But again, guys, this is one that I'm never going to take out of the box, and I'm never going to get rid of. Just because, you know, he is a legend, and I love this pop. I love WWE. Um, which, I will show you guys later, uh, if you guys really want a room tour um, on my WWE section. But... This has still has tape. I, I I can swear to you guys on my mom, my dad, my whole family that I love. I did not tape this thing up. This thing had tape when this guy dropped it off. So there's tape right there. And there's tape right there. Believe it or not, I still don't have the supplies to uh, go ship you guys out your things if the thing comes. I will get those soon uh, right when we hit 400. I will make sure that I have them before then. But tape is literally the number one item I want to get because I don't have tape in my house, which is crazy. But this thing is currently going for like 30, I want to say it was 37, but I think this thing, this thing might be 37. If it's not 37, this thing is $32. But this thing, PPG value is $37. I will show you guys at the end, which is coming up soon. This is a pop. I love this pop so much. So yeah. 
I'm just speechless right now. I came up in I so I lost I lost five Funko Pops. You know, which is good. Look, so I traded the guy the Joker that I had, the purple Joker. Um I traded him the Groot, the Iron Man, the Doctor Strange, and Amethyst. That was five Funko Pops. Those from Amethyst was 33. The other ones came up to like maybe some more like five, four, six, eight. It was uh, like all I know is in total value I counted it was like at least fifty dollars that I lost. And when he gave me these, the immediate thing I did was scan them on the Funko app. These things to in total value came up to 137 or 147 dollars, guys. You guys have seen the pictures, their total values. I think we picked up a good deal. Um, shout outs to the guy that made the trade with me if he uh, watches my channel or subscribe to me. But yeah, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Enjoy this little thing. After this thing's over, I will uh, um, talk to you guys again. So yeah guys, yeah guys, that was the um, thing of the prices, as you guys can see, I came up in a good deal, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, um, like the video, like it, smash that like button until it turns blue, this one, don't click the one that looks like this, because if you do, well, come on, why are you even subscribed, click the one that looks like this, If and if you're not subscribed, subscribe, share this to your friends, at 400 subscribers, we're giving away three Funko Pops, we're giving away the Hulk, we're giving away the SDCC exclusive gearhead, and we're giving away a Hello Neighbor Pop, but also I've changed that, when, uh, I will also say this in the live stream, when, not, not, not only will you, the three winners be getting that pop, you will also be receiving the little Funko Pop keychain, I have a Harry Potter uh, bird, a Fortnite default, and a, the cat from Captain Marvel. So I will let you guys choose those also as a secondary choice. Maybe, no, yeah, I'll let you guys choose this as a secondary choice. But yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, share this to your friends because at 400, we are giving those away. But yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.